Today we're going to go over some of the things that are going to make you a better point guard. Okay, we're going to look at some of the areas that some of the great point guards in the league, right, and college, the characteristics that they have that make them those great lead guards. Okay, the first thing we're going to go over today is pace, right, and pace can mean a bunch of different things. Right, but right now we're gonna talk about the ability, right, for that player, right, point guard or guard, to control the pace at that tempo the team needs at that moment, right? So that's extremely important, right? Knowing the tempo of the game. If that team is going on a run, right, we don't wanna throw up, right, quick shots and let them get in transition, right? If we're going on a run, right, maybe we're kicking it to those guys and getting up quick shots because we're in the flow of that game, All right? So as a great point guard, right, you need to, to really have that pulse of the team and what's going on, All right? So that's one of the first things when we talk about pace, controlling the pace of the game, right? How quick you're going to play or how slow you're going to play, right? The other thing is going to break down more into skills, right? And we want to talk about pace with great guards, Right? That's talking about slowing down when I need to slow down, right? getting the spots, getting the ball where it needs to go, having pace to be able to read in those moments. That's going to also include being able to have great pace right, in ball screen situations. Okay, so right now we're just going to go over a couple things right, that let you have great pace as your skill set. Right? So what we're going to do, we're going to go over a heavy step. Right, we're going to go over speed stops right, and different types of drags that are going to allow you right, to slow against aggressive defenders, right, read the court, and get your team into offensive actions or scoring opportunities. Right now, we're going to go over heavy steps right, into different types of speed stops. All right, so if we're getting pressured in that full court, and it can be half court, you got to have different things within your skill set that can make you play slow to quick right, and then quick to slow. That's going to keep that defender always off balance. All right, it's also going to get you to spots right, and relieve that pressure to where you can get into the offense right, or different actions you may need to. So the first thing we're going to do is just talk about a heavy step. All right, so if I'm getting pressured right here, right, a heavy step is an inside step that's just going to slow you down. So I may be attacking full speed, right, defenders running with me, they don't know when I'm going to stop. Right, so as I'm attacking here, off this inside step, if I'm being pressured, right, I may slow, let them run across my frame. Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is heavy step, right, into a load exchange. So as they run across my frame, I'm gonna go through my legs, right? As I go through my legs here, right foot is now gonna come across and we're gonna heavy again off that, right? So again, I wanna bounce heavy, right? As I heavy, we're having that quick rotation with our hip right turning that's our explosive movement then it's going to be right left into that speed stop exchange that's my slow from here i just want to turn that dribble and bounce back right so that's going to create space away from that defender as we turn with that pace right and bounce back <laughs> and then i'm just going to pull that ball back Right, we go again, remember quick, right to slow. Quick, slow, load exchange. Ooh. Right, notice how I'm just changing speed right within each movement. So I'm always gonna keep that defender right now off balance to where I can go slow to quick or quick to slow. Okay, now we're gonna look at a speed stop. When we speed stop, right, I'm gonna attack quick, right? My defender's gonna now beat me to that spot, right? So I know what I'm doing right now. I just wanna create space. So as I drop right here and I attack, I'm playing against an aggressive defender. They sprint across my frame. I'm gonna go left, right into that stop, right? From here, I'm gonna step my foot across their frame here, right? I wanna turn, I'm gonna bounce off and then open up. Okay, what that's going to do is create space, okay, and then allow me to attack and read. So a lot of times when we talk about pace, right, we want to talk about pace and then having those opportunities to set ourselves up where we can now read our defender, right, to attack, right? Whether we want to get, again, right, maybe we're going this way. We know we have a pin down over here, right, for one of our better shooters. They're on high side on my hip, so I would have to throw it here. I want to attack right, speed stop, they come across my frame, now I'm able to deliver that pass, right, on time to my shooter, all right, so right now, right, obviously it's just us, so we're going to drop, right, we're going to go left, right, from here I want to step, I'm going to turn the ball, I'm going to float back into that hip rotation, when you land here is when you can read, 
right? For the sake of what we're doing right now, I'm gonna go right left as hard as I can into another speed stop, and then we're just gonna bounce off, right, after we do that. Okay, within pace, we want to talk about the ability to be quick with the basketball. All right, so when we're talking about pace, right, we're talking about being quick also. All right, so right now when we're here, all right, if I have maybe an aggressive defender and I create a little bit of space, if I want to relieve that pressure, almost give him that wow factor of I don't want to get up and have to guard him tight, you want to have quick handle, right, and feet. All right, so what we're going to do right now, we're going to have a quick breakdown with our handle. That's going to put that defender on their heels. All right, and that's what we want with aggressive defenders. Defenders on their heels, right? Then they maybe close out, we attack, right? Slow again and get to our spot. So our first thing we're gonna do, all right, we're gonna allow you to be really creative with this, right? Whatever we wanna do with our handle, it's gotta be quick and explosive, right? Feet and ball work together. Out of that, right, we're gonna get into some type of move. I want you to attack, right? We're gonna work on punch drags now. So a punch drag is gonna be a stop off my outside foot where I'm punching the ball. We don't want the ball out where that defender can swipe it. We wanna protect it now, right, right with our leg. We're bouncing that ball almost on that back heel, protecting the basketball. So we're gonna break down quick with a handle, have pace, explode. After that, we're getting to a punch drag. We just wanna bounce back into it. 